Tonight, an Arizona woman is lucky to be alive after a crash left her trapped in her vehicle for nearly two days. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us for 12 News at 10. I'm Kariba Devine. I'm Mark Curtis. Authorities rescued the woman Saturday in a remote area about 10 miles north of Lake Pleasant. Team 12's Chase Golightly is there tonight to tell us how she survived. Not only was she stuck in the Arizona desert, but the sheriff's office tells me she was also trapped in her car after she somehow drove off the road and fell 200 feet down. Just off this dirt road, surrounded by nothing but saguaros and desert, a woman in her 50s survived for 36 hours in her car. She was trapped in there. Paul Wick, a spokesperson for the Yavapai County Sheriff's Office, sent us these photos of the aftermath. You can see the heavy damage the car received from falling 200 feet off an embankment on Castle Hot Springs Road. In an area with no cell phone service, but what saved her were cyclists who were on that same road and somehow saw the car. They were able to GPS the location. A sheriff's deputy arrived and called Arizona Department of Public Safety for rescue. The deputy then went down the embankment themselves and saw that the woman was miraculously alive. She was a little bit dehydrated. So how could someone survive being trapped for this long in their car with no help? She had uh, some water, some snacks, just barely able to make it that far. The woman suffered non-life threatening injuries and was airlifted to a Phoenix area hospital for treatment. The sheriff's office at this time doesn't know what exactly led to the crash. But on Monday afternoon, we did see that same car she was trapped in getting towed away from the crash scene. She's lucky to survive the car wreck. Cody Lundin is a survival expert who teaches classes on how to live in the desert. He says the woman having water in her car was key, but getting trapped inside may have also played a role in keeping her alive. And frankly, not doing a whole lot. If you're trapped in your car, you're not moving around, exerting, sweating, blowing for more metabolic water. Lundin also encourages people to be prepared when making any kind of trip, whether it be on vacation or just going to the store. So have water, tell someone where you're going, have a way to make shade, you know, to get out of the sun and, and just go prepare. There's no excuse to not have water in Arizona, especially in the summertime. We're near Morristown. Chase Lightly, 12 News. All right, Chase. Thank you.